We get up from a chair a lot of the time, right? We're either in standing or in sitting, really, most of our lives, even driving. So, how to get better at doing these exercises good is to incorporate it into something you do every single day, every single movement. So a sit to stand is a really good squat practice. So what we want to do is position one, you want your feet underneath your hips and your knees and your shoulders if you like the wider stance. You want to have them underneath you in general, not too far out in front. From here, you want to hinge at the hips so your chest tilts forward a little bit so that weight is going directly down through your legs. And then, looking forward, push that chest forward, press your feet down. You want to stand up and squeeze your bum. You want to make sure that your knees aren't magnetized together and they stay apart or in line with everything so that we use our bum and our quads very effectively. And from there, when you stand up, you want to make sure that you squeeze your bum at the top. We don't finish a squat and go for a walk. Maximize the efficiency of your sit to stand. Coming back down, the same applies just in reverse. Hinge your hips back, so open them up, and then push your bum back. Keep your feet on the floor, underneath your hips. Don't let your knees come closer together, keep them apart, and sit back down. Good luck.